Buy Face Lift was a promotional tool because we were not selling anything. <laughs> we were out on tour with with Iggy Pop and Extreme, and we had an idea to record a live show and then give it away for free with the record. Filmed it in Seattle. Pearl Jam had wasn't Pearl Jam. Ed had just got there. They'd never played really. And Temple of the Dog. And Temple of the Dog. We had them both play with us, and then we played at this little theater called the Moore Theater, and they filmed it in black and white on a track. We just now listened back to it. The and audio like, was not that great. I'm like, can you make my drums sound like drums? He's like, there's no mics on most of it. I'm like, really? Is that how we roll back then? <laughs> It was a pretty cool night though. It was a great because night. Because of, you know, having the Mookie guys and having Temple too, you know. Uh, it's a great vibe, man. played and they recorded it so yeah. we, we played the song a bunch of times i think there was some discussion of us lips uh, lip syncing to the track and we're like no nah, we're not going to do that man so yeah. for the people to talk it's got to be on tape and we're like okay well we'll play the songs and you can record us we did until we thought they were good enough and then kind of lip sync back to your live performance you know while they're dancing yeah. around in the audience while we're playing in the background or whatever so that was kind of odd just yeah. you know the first kind of experience around filmmaking yeah we, it, yeah, we weren't in a real club. We, they made a fake yeah. club, a movie type one on the, in a... Empty pier downtown. Yeah, in a pier down on the waterfront. I was there when they filmed that scene. It was some of the most impressive hair flipping I've ever seen in my life. I mean, Seattle bands are really good hair flippers, but this was kind of the most hair flipping. They took the total prize for hair flipping with that one. I said they got something. 